So now well, let's do um, the same exercise that we did before. That's what they are telling us. So I'm going to copy the same structure. But now they want me to do the same for this exercise, but only include the head tag. So they want me to remove the body. And in the head, they want me to add an H1 heading. OK, let's try that. So an H1. I'm going to replace this with a closing H1. And let's try it. And it's showing. You see how it's showing? Like if you put some HTML on the head, even though it's not supposed to show, it shows. Not like the title that it wasn't showing. When we put in the last exercise, we put the title. Let me put the title again. I'm going to put I am a title. And then let's run it again. You see how the title doesn't show, but it shows on the top. Look, here at the top. It's just I am a title. So this is not a good practice, the putting HTML on the head. And I until now, I thought it was not going to show, but it, apparently it shows. But it's still, you don't want to put it there. Like, don't put anything on the head that is supposed to show. The other stuff that you are going to put in the head are more like metadata, data about the website. Like, for example, some keywords that you think are important for the website so that Google ranks the website better, or what information do you want to show up on social media when people share the website. That's called a meta description and some others. There's a whole science behind it. It's called search engine optimization. And all, all of that you got to put on the head. And some other stuff on the body as well, but on the head you put some of it. So that's it.